welcome back in this video tutorial we are going to see how to download georeferenced high resolution satellite images using QGIS so basically what we are going to do is we are going to use uh, the base maps from which we are going to uh, download the satellite images which is georeferenced and of high resolution so in order to add a base map you can see x y and z tiles so if you are using the latest QGIS you will be finding it and uh, here from here you can choose Google satellite you can drag it and drop it otherwise if you don't find the XN, uh, XYZ tiles you can use HCM GAS plugin so let us see how to install the plugin so select plugins manage and install plugin so now select all and at the top just type in HCM GAS and you'll be getting the plugin we need to just install it within a few seconds it will be installed so you can see here it has been successfully installed so you can also add the base maps from HCMJS plugin you can see it at the top HCMJS and uh, under that you can find base maps and you can select once again select Google satellite images which we have already loaded from the X and Z tiles these are same okay right so you can also use another base map so that you can I, uh, easily go on and find your location or area of uh, interest so for that I am going to use ESRI street so that we can easily choose our area of interest so for example uh, if you just focus on Australia so you can download this uh, image for the entire world in this case I am just going to show it for Australia and we are going to focus on Sydney right so this is the Sydney city right and after that we are going to disable this ESRI street and now you can see here how the image looks like so let me go to a particular region so you can see here how the image is looking like right okay now let us see how to download this image okay so this is my area of interest right and after that uh, you can see in a processing toolbox if you don't find the processing toolbox uh, you can see at the top processing just enable this toolbox right and after that you can find raster tools inside that you can use convert maps map to raster if you don't find it here uh, if you dif if you are uh, finding it difficult you can just type it at the top search and you can get the tool so we are going to use this tool to download this imagery so first let us select the extent so you can use the current map extent canvas extent for example this is the current canvas extent otherwise you can customize it based uh, by uh, draw on a map can canvas for example you can just draw like this and select your area of interest once you have done it you can choose the map units okay right so if you are going to have a high resolution image you should be going beyond 1 meter from uh, 5 meter below uh, 30 centimeters you can go so in this case I am going to give 1 meter right the map units is in your meters so after that you can find layers to be rendered so which image uh, we are interested in we are interested in the Google satellite image right we are going to select it click OK and you could save the output location of this file defaultly it will be saved as a temporary file or if you want to save it to any particular location you use an option save to file so here let us create a folder satellite image So here let us select the file format. So I'm going to choose TIFF and let us give a name for it Imagery 1. Save it. So let us click on run and begin the process. So now you can see here the image has been successfully added. Let us remove the base map and if you just zoom in you can see the clarity of this image. Right? So you can use it for your analysis. 
if you want the image to be much uh, uh, clear you can just zoom in as much as possible and you can download such image or uh, let us try and again we can whether we can increase the resolution so draw on a map canvas so let us right so let us once again draw so this time let us put 0 0.50 right and after that select the base map which you are interested in and save it to a location so this time we have increased the resolution right you can see 0 0.50 so let us click on run and see what it is up to so if you are putting 0.5 usually it may take some time to download based on your internet connection and the server so the download has been completed it took me around 16 minutes so that is based on our internet speed and uh, the server speed right now let us zoom in you can see the clarity and you can check the previous image you can see the difference this is because of the resolution higher the resolution more the clarity of the image will be you can also download the uh, low resolution image so let, let me show you how it looks like so you can use once again use this option and once again we can draw a map canvas like this like this you can draw one and after that let us enable the google satellite imagery and here let us uh, assign the map units as 30 meters so 30 minutes if you download landsat 8 image it is around 30 meters now let us run the file i am going to save it as a temporary file only so you can see the difference of the 30 meter resolution image how it is looking like if you zoom in uh, you will be not getting uh, much more detail right and uh, we can also try it couple of times for example what will be a 10 meter image look like So let us see the difference. So yeah, so this is the 10 meter resolution image. You can see the difference between the 10 meter resolution, 30 meter resolution, and you can see this is 0.5 meter resolution. The second which we have downloaded. Pardon me. So my laptop's uh, hardware capacity is uh, a bit slow. That's why you can see pixels like formation. You can clearly see the differentiation between the high resolution image and low resolution image. So you can also find the difference for example if I just zoom in here over here. So let us see the difference. You can see this uh, place over here and uh, yeah. So this is 1 meter resolution image right and if I just uh, switch over to the 0 0.5 meter resolution image this is how the uh, resolution looks like and this is how the 30 meter image looks like no information we are, we are not we are getting any information and if you are switching to 10 meter resolution image this is how it looks like so you can see the comparison of this uh, right so i hope this video might be helpful for you for your uh, spatial analysis or mapping your city so higher the resolution of the image more clarity will be uh, you will be getting and you can use uh, coarse and uh, coarse uh, resolution image also if it is a large very very large scale analysis you can do it for land use land cover large scale analysis otherwise uh, the uh, high resolution image suits you the best because each pixels covers that much information as you can see here this pixel size is alone 
you can see the pixel size so it will be coming somewhere around so 0 0.4 meters you can also convert to centimeters you can see the pixels uh, resolution that is 41 centimeters the uh, second imagery which you have downloaded and if you are uh, going with the first imagery which is 1 meter resolution you can see the difference each pixel size you can see this pixel size so it is covering around uh, 82 or 83 centimeter around 1 meters right and if you are moving with the 30 meter resolution image you can see how much of uh, area it is covering 1 pixel covers around 30 meters you can see it in meters it is covering around 25 meters approximately it will be coming around 30 meters and if you check with the 10 meter resolution image you will be seeing the pixel size right you can see it is around 8.2 so that is the difference if you are going with the high resolution image uh, pixels will be very uh, each pixel will be covering high details as you can see in this scene so thanks for watching if you find this video useful please do like and subscribe the channel goodbye everyone